will be uh, painting my goalie mask here, my Bauer Enemy 7. Uh, so far what I've done is I removed the, the harness from the back. Um, I've taken it off. I peeled off uh, one sticker here. Um, so my plan today is um, I'm just going to uh, sand the back off and um, draw on a design and um, start uh, painting it with my Posca paint pens. Um, so once again, I'm going to finish uh, this mask um, in the next uh, few weeks when I get back from vacation. Uh, basically, I'm going to go with a brick design. Um, I'm going to have an oiler crest up here because I'm an oiler fan and I wanted to match my uh, oiler jersey that I have. But basically, my equipment's red and white, so my helmet is going to be in that uh, in those colors. So what I'm doing here, guys, is I'm using a frog tape that I picked up from my local Home Depot. And I'm just going to tape off uh, the inside mat, the foam, the head protection um, area here. I'm just going to tape it off uh, before I sand because I don't want any uh, uh, dust particles uh, touching the... Okay guys, so here's my back plate. The foam is all covered up with uh, uh, green fog tape. Uh, here are some of the supplies I'll be using. Uh, 600 grit sand sandpaper, that's just to um, reduce the shine, take the shine away from my... Uh, uh, goalie mask there. Um, I, th I then have some 3M wet dry sandpaper and as well as this very fine uh, uh, sandpaper here which I'll use uh, afterwards and most importantly um, I have my Posca paint pens here. Um, there's a few different colors in there um, and I'll go over everything uh, in a little bit. So yeah, got this uh, taped off and then uh, I'm going to start sanding this down in a little bit and uh, put on my uh, uh, design, nothing too fancy on the back plate, just a couple red bars or something and uh, my name. Alright guys, see you soon. So, uh, this goes. I'm just going to start off really slowly, um, see how it goes. Oh yeah, you could, you could tell immediately that uh, uh, it's working, I'm just going to, you can see the shine come off on the sandpaper. I'm just going to fold this a little bit smaller. Okay guys, I just uh, finished uh, sanding the back plate. As you can see, the shine is practically completely gone. Um, you can see the all the uh, shine that has come off all the on the sandpaper there. Um, comparing uh, my Bauer mask to the back plate, you can see my currently my Bauer mask uh, has some pencil drawing on it. That's just uh, for rough, just for fun. Um, but the shine is completely gone from the back plate to the mask. You can see how the mask is quite shiny there. Okay guys, I'm now using a 5M. It's a bigger felt marker. Posca paint pen. So now I'm going to go ahead and uh, paint the lines in and get a nice red uh, band along the back here. So what you want to do is you want to shake the pens for a good 30 seconds up to a minute if you want. And uh, dab it on a, on a piece of paper or something so you can see that the ink is coming through. Almost done the first band. I'm just going to continue to uh, color this in here. done. So now I'm just going to go around and uh, do a little touch up here and there.
Hey guys, um, I took a little break for a little while. Um, what I've done now is I've used a couple different grits of sandpaper and I've uh, went around the mask. And um, I think I did a pretty good job. I took a lot of the shine off. There might be a slight couple areas that have a bit of shine, but uh, it's pretty it's pretty feeling good now. Um, but what I am going to do is I don't want the bower to be on here. It didn't come off with the sandpaper. Um, so I'm going to use the thicker Posca pen here, the white one. It's a 17K. And I'm just going to try a little bit on um, on the bower sign to see if it comes off or, or if I can cover it up. Um, if it doesn't look well, the Posca paint pens, all you need is water and soap and it uh, will come right off. So, yeah, I'm just going to cover this up and then uh, um, I'm going to take it from there. So stay tuned, guys. Hey guys, the Reebok Goalie finally completed my uh, Bauer Enemy 7 Goalie Mask paint job. Um, the lighting is not the greatest, but it has a beautiful uh, shine to it. Got Uzi on the chin. Got a couple maple leaves along the top here. Uh, brickwork underneath. I have the Reebok Goalie hand written on the along the bottom there. So it turned out pretty good. I'm pretty happy with it. And I uh, decided to put oiler colors on the other side just because uh, I got that team-issued uh, goalie jersey. Uh, we have the oiler symbol there uh, broken up here with some chunks falling down. The same with the front here on the chin area. Number 30 on the side. Uh, as you can see, you might see it there. There's a nice shine. Uh, I did about eight coats of uh, clear coat and the final one was quite heavy. Um, there's a longer oil drop on the top. Here's the top of it there. Oiler symbol. Nice shine. And the back plate um, drew a little goalie character. The Reebok goalie as well. A couple oil drops. Um, that's my name in Korean, number 30. So all in all, it turned out pretty good. Posca paint pens. And my goalie mask. Any questions, let me know.